Guys, what's going on? My name is Luis, and God bless every single one of you. Today is November 10, 2023, and welcome to the Grand Supreme News Channel. All right, guys, so we have some urgent information coming out. If you can, please share this video. And it says here, emergency declared after fire at historic military blimp hangar spews asbestos, heavy metals, into the air. A state of emergency has been declared, guys. And it says here, Orange County officials declared a state of emergency Thursday night due to the danger posed by the air pollution from the fire, which besides uh, asbestos, a very powerful uh, stuff was found to contain lead, uh, arsenic, nickel, and other heavy metals. All right, so we're going to see what's going on here, guys. And um, basically, they're sounding the alarm here in the state of California. I do believe it's in California, if I'm not mistaken. Give me a second here. Uh, give me one second, guys. So, yeah, I do believe it's the uh, state of California. Yep. So parks and schools shut in California after this, you know what, found in burned World War II era blimp hangar. All right, if you can, please share this video. And I just post a very powerful video late last night. Texas, you have experts out there telling many uh, to be prepared, prep, when it comes to, you know, smoke and stuff like that, that is impacting the air. All right. So in Texas, there were 25 plants that were impacted. We're talking about facility 25 in the year 2023 alone. Experts are saying that some of these stuff are in the air and it stays there for like a couple of weeks. And again, some people reporting that, uh, you know, they feel tired, headache or other stuff. It's because a lot of these things are in the air. And now California, we are seeing one happening out there. So the videos I'm posting about this is very important that you share it. Uh, I'm putting out very good stuff, uh, how to prep and how to get, you know, how to be prepared with all these events going on uh, around the world. All right, so uh, let's see what's going on here, guys. And by the way, if uh, you guys want to check out the video of Texas, give me a second here. Yeah, so this is the one. Uh, expert warns Texans to prep. So this link here will be in the comments box. You got to check that video out. It's very important. Also, guys, make sure you follow me at the Rise Up Warrior. I'm posting videos on this channel. All right. So um, yeah, there's gonna be another video I'm gonna post on this channel. And uh, I want to thank everybody so much for the love and support. Thank you so much for sharing the video. Thank you so much for subscribing. And thank you so much for the support, either through Patreon or PayPal. Your support truly helps out. All right. So yesterday we saw uh, our, well, we went to go see a house. We are planning to buy a home. And it's a very nice house, uh, almost 1,600 square feet, um, three bedroom, two bath, a shed in the backyard, big land. Um, it's like almost in a farm area. It's away from the city. It's very nice, so we're still working on that, and uh, we want to thank everybody so much for the prayers. Thank you so much for that, guys. Uh, we're trying to look for our first home, and uh, hopefully everything goes well. And uh, we're going to keep it updated with this uh, first home journey. All right, <clears throat> so it says here, parks and schools were closed Thursday in a southern California city after officials found some very powerful stuff. Um... In the charred debris of a historic WW2 era blimp hangar. Now, the city of Tustin closed at least nine parks and urged many to limit outdoor activity to induce their exposure to ash after this, you know what, was detected in preliminary samples of ash and debris. So, again, it's very important to follow these uh, steps and instruction, especially uh, there's been a lot of reports of people feeling tired. So, um, again, wear your MASK. 
uh, if you live around this area. So uh, again, please uh, be safe out there. Both Orange County and the city also declared a local state of emergency over concerns that this thing and other powerful stuff could have polluted the air and ground. So Texas and California, they're putting out warnings. The county announcement said testing of air and ash uh, samples found indication of this thing and heavy metals, including lead, arsenic, and nickel. Now, the city's emergency declaration said that the possibility of airborne, uh, you know, what pose condition of extreme peril to the safety of persons and property uh, that only local, state, and federal efforts can mitigate. Southern California air quality regulates will continue to analyze samples from areas around the hangar for toxic gases and metals, the city said in a statement. Now, this event happened, I think, two days ago. I remember uh, posting a video about this. It happened in the early mornings. Uh, I think it happened like around 5 a.m. or 6 a.m. out there in California. At first, uh, at first, I thought it was another country, but uh, they mentioned it was California. I'm like, wow. So it was a huge event that happened, I think, two or three days ago. Now we are seeing the aftermath, the air. All right, so schools were closed Thursday to ensure student safety in the Testing uh, Unified School District, some 35 miles, that's 56 kilometers, southeast of Los Angeles, a Veterans Day event plan for Saturday was canceled. The blaze broke out early Tuesday at the massive wooden hangar, which was one of the two built in 1942 by the U.S. Navy to house military blimps. The cause of this event was under investigation. Yeah. So that's where we are right now. Give me a second here. This, this is military website that is putting out the information, and that's this one right here. I'm gonna click on it, but the problem here is this article uh, is, is wide, and I can't share everything because, uh, again, the OBS will not allow it. It's kind of weird. I don't know why they make articles like this. Let me just show you, see that? It's, there's no way for me to fix this. But uh, I want to read some of this stuff because this is coming out from the military website. All right, so it's going to be really hard to read this one here. See? Again, there's no way for me to, uh, to fix this. I mean, that's way too wide. Let me just remove myself really quick here. Let me see if I can read some of this stuff. Yeah, this is really small. I'm going to have to take the OBS out. All right, so once again, um, Orange County officials declare a state of emergency Thursday night due to the danger posed by the air pollution from the event, uh, which besi uh, besides this powerful stuff was found to contain lead arsenic, nickel, and other heavy metals. The pollution alert from the South Coast Air Quality Management District came two days after a fire began to engulf one of the World War II era hangars uh, in now defunct Marine Corps Air Station in Tustin, sending large plumes of smoke into the air. Extensive portion collapsed as fire flames dev uh, devoured the large, mostly wooden structure which reached 17 stories high and 1,000 feet long. Late Wednesday night, Tustin uh, Unified School uh, District, Mr. Mark Johnson said that because of concerns about this powerful stuff coming from the fire, school's official had decided to shut down local campuses. The decision came after a nighttime conference call and with a local agency, including AQMD, Johnson said in an email, which was later posted on the district website. 
school will remain closed Friday. Um, yeah, there's a lot of information here, guys. But these words are really small, so I'm just going to share this link on my Twitter account. If you guys want to check it out, the link will be in the comments box. And just looking at that, look at that smoke. Yeah. You guys already know Texas scene one, two. All right. So if you guys missed that video of Texas, the link will be in the comments box. You have experts telling many you need to prep because if this thing is happening, and this is a trending going on facilities and train der uh, derailments and whatever, uh, you may want to start uh, preparing. Now, they're still doing investigation. We still don't have the answer what's causing all these events. So once again, guys, it remains a mystery, unsolved mystery. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Again, we're going to be praying for a lot of people out there in California. If you can, make sure you follow me on my channel. New one, the link will be in the comments box. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Once again, for those of you that want to give a like to Christ, you can email me. My email is in the description box. Me and my wife are here to help many and to lead many to the righteous path. And that's the path of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. For those of you that want to send us letters or prayer requests, you can send it to me, Luis Santiago, or my wife, Jessica Santiago, at 3432 U.S. Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34691. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. God bless you all. Put your faith and trust in Jesus Christ, for he's the only way, the truth, and the life. No one gets to the Father but through Jesus. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time later. Peace.